Hi, I'm Megan. I study maths at the University of Sussex. When you're at school, everyone thinks maths is really boring and really hard. But as you get older, you can see that maths is actually everywhere. An example of an everyday activity where you might see maths would just be going to a coffee shop. So you'd walk in and you'd get in a queue. When should you join a queue? How quick is the queue going to go? You've got loads of different kinds of coffee. What coffee makes the best profit? You might get your phone out, you do a bit of internet banking, do a bit of reading, but that's all coded. So we're at Gatwick today, and if we think about how you schedule flight departures, the baggage haul, how does all of that work? Well, it's all based on maths. You know, it's all simultaneous equations. It's all things that you think you're never going to use again when you study them at GCSE, but actually they are everywhere. When I first started university, I wasn't sure what I wanted to do job-wise and that's why I liked the fact that our modules were set out for us and gave us a really broad and deep understanding of maths in general. So I realised that I wanted to do a job where I was using maths but solving real-life situations. I went to a talk in the library by the Career Centre and I heard the Government Operational Research Team. And that's exactly what it is, it's taking real life problems and using maths to model them and maths to solve them. So when I came to apply for placement years, I specifically looked for roles doing that and that's how I came across my placement year at NATS. So if you look outside and stay, you can see there's actually quite poor visibility. I worked on a project looking at low visibility conditions. Bristol Airport were just interested in knowing how this would affect their departures and arrival count. A piece of my work was actually used in a government document advising on Heathrow's third runway. It's only a little piece, but it's something I'm really proud of. I think the foundation year at Sussex really prepared me for the rest of my degree. I didn't have the best A-levels coming to university. You get a lot of support from the department, so when you start you get given an academic advisor who sees you through your whole degree. The Bridge Cafe is like the hub of the MPS department. You stay with your friends all day, you work through problems together because maths is actually quite a social degree. We've got the foyer, which is a great social space for us to learn, but we also have the study spaces. I found that there's a lot of mixing across the year, so I've got friends that are in loads of different year groups and that's another person that you can always ask for help with a problem. I've been really lucky when I've gone to university because I've fallen in with a group of friends who really enjoy their degree as well and I think it's so different compared to school. It's cool to be clever, it's cool to do well. It is like a family within the department and it's an experience that you'll never forget.